All right, Shantae time. If you're going to do a video game, MGBA is fantastic. What advantage does it have over um, Visual Boy Advance? That's what I usually use. It's the only one I have. Shantae, half genie hero. All right, they added a hardcore mode. I'm not sure if that was in yet when I played last. I'm not gonna play it. All right, somebody said it was like crazy hard. I remember it was, somebody was playing it when I streamed last and it's really friggin' hard. Like, I'm not sure it's like Ghosts and Goblins hard, but they said they're having real trouble with it. Uh, what am I doing again? Alright, I think I'm supposed to get all of these risky items. I think you need to get something from each of the barons, that's right. Any games to the anime style you'd recommend? Um, if you haven't checked out Neptunia, I would say Mega Dimension Neptunia is probably the best game to start with. Um, I haven't really looked too much at what's on there. I know there's a lot of good stuff, but uh, I like a lot of things, so I don't really tend to pick through sales for recommendations because I'd be there all day. I want more Squid Baron fan art. Okay. Maybe Squid Baron doesn't have a thing. I think the other ones do, though. Oh, right, no, he had a poster that I need to bring to that one dude. Right? Yeah, I got the poster. I need to bring that over to... Whatever. What's up, Ammo Baron? Ammo Baron, what are you doing here? What's it look like? I'm looking for spare parts! I need to repair my ship and get her airborne. My entire fleet's up there just burning fuel. Just land, idiots. If I had five pieces of scrap metal, could fit my ship and get out of your lousy hair. Wait, hold the phone. Is that scrap metal for yours, truly? Uh, sure! Wooshwa, that's not enough. Come when there's five of them. Oh, okay. Oh, I only have two. Okay. Sunken souls. Oh no, I need to collect all of the things. That's what this is, isn't it? I was just complaining about the backtracking. And it is, in fact, time to backtrack. How's the audio balance, by the way? This feels a little loud. I think I got this. Yeah, I think I got his. It's only three barons, though. Maybe Squid Baron's poster does lead to something. Eh, whatever. So I think we're just in get all of the things mode. And I don't want to fight another Wily's castle and then not get the true ending, so I'm just gonna get everything. Because frickin' the final castle in uh, What's-Its-Face, um, Pirate's Curse, is ridiculous. Oh, we got new thing! Alright, no, that's the final area. We don't want to go there. So we got everything at Hypno Baron's Cast. Wait. Did we get everything? Because I thought... I thought that one guy needed a thing. But maybe that's not listed that way. I'm pretty sure we need to bring that black lit... Or the, the black velvet thing. To that one zombie dude. Does MGBA, or does, does Visual Boy Advance really not uh, do full screen? I guess I don't usually full screen my emulators anyway. Because I, I have three monitors and full screen kind of sucks. You better get used to using Harpy. Oh no! I don't like the sound of that at all. Because that is really weird to use. Orange! Delicious orange. Excuse me, miss. Oh, wait. Precious treats? Oh, ghost girl! She really reminds me of that ghost song. I think Way Forward could actually make a really good... What is, what is the name of that band? Um... Oh, there he is! I think WayForward could make a really good um, 
game in the style of that that music video, the ghost one. Hey, you've got one. Let me see that. Here's your velvet poster, buddy. This ain't at all what I expected. It's way better! Yeah, I'm digging this. Here. You got the squid poster! Hell yeah! We got Squid Baron fan art. Poe picked up that sorry looking squid poster at Nerd <laughs> NerdCon. No backsies. Stay classy, Abner. Whatever, it's exactly what I needed, Chante. You can deal with it. Uh, how do I dance? There we go. Isn't that like, get the hell out of Dodge dance? Wait, no, that's... Um, that's just the whistle. I am glad there's a get the hell out of Dodge option. That's something I... Neptunia doesn't get enough credit for, just... Get the hell out of dungeon button. Like an escape rope that works everywhere. Um... Wow, I'm missing a lot of crap here. Pretty much done, Tasseltown. Where are the keys, though? Oh, no, that's for fan art. I don't need that. Well, let's give Squid Baron his fan art. Oh, they're adding online multiplayer? I've never gotten Netplay to work in an emulator, but I've never really tried an incredible amount. She has a reference to Nikki, the girl from the Nintendo message system. Huh. I guess her glasses are the same. I never really used that. I'm kind of surprised anyone used that. But then I guess people used PictoChat on 3DS. Or normal DS. Man, what, what a confusing set of freaking names. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of glad that the DS line is po probably dead with Switch. Keep the Squid Baron fan art coming. Hey, that Squid poster that you have looks epic! Give me that! He gave Squid Poster. Oops, I've got to get this laminated. Here, something for you in return. You got Risky's buckle. Why did you steal part of her pants? Looks like I broke off a size seven fashionable leather boot that smelled great. Squid Baron, get out of my house. I don't like you anymore. I'm kink shaming Squid Baron, that's it. So I need scrap metal. Um, what do I do with sunken souls? I'm sure those are needed for something. Oh. <laughs> You're just creeping in the freaking bathhouse? Excuse you. Hypno Baron, what are you doing here? It's impossible to think with that more and work with that moronic squin baron. I agree. So I'm starting out over fresh. I refuse to be reduced to comical banter. I will rebuild an empire of fear by feeding on sunken souls. Up oh, there you go. I command you to find ten of them. Fail in this, and I will inhabit the minds of all the citizenry of Skull, Skull Town, driving them to madness. Sounds more like the Hypno Baron I know. Bring me the sunken souls. Ha ha ha. Yeah, nah. No? Is your wish then to see the citizenry plunged into insanity? Yes. See, I gotta, like I said, find the things. Exciting gameplay. I do kind of get the feel that, like, they've ran out of their budget. And, I mean, it does look great, so I'm kind of not too surprised. Like, all the animations can't be cheap. But I get the impression that they kind of ran out of things. And, uh... Ended up having to try to, you know, do some reuse to get the standard Shantae length out of there. Ready. It's kind of a shame they didn't go, like, like, they want the collectathon part of Metroidvania, but it doesn't really have the design of one, which is what makes the collecting part of a metroidvania not so bad. Alright, we're supposed to dance. Right, let's see if we can find things with Harpy. Oh, nope, that's the ceiling. Okay. I guess it's all in the second area then? I think there's some good games on GBA with the the tilt sensor. There's the WarioWare game and uh, WarioWare Twisted, I think. 
And there's Kirby Tilt and Tumble, which looks really good. I've never had either of those. I think there's a Yoshi game too. I'm not sure if that's any good though. Do we want hints on collectibles? I, I'm not sure how much trouble I have. I think I have all of the stuff to get them. I just need to run through all the areas. If I'm being stupid and missing things, go ahead and let me know, I guess, because, like, this is just, you know, stretching out the gameplay. I don't really care at this point. Wait, that's not mermaid. Spider girls are just like mermaids of the land, you see. Oh, yeah, I think I do I am missing some stuff down here. Get, get out of here. Get, no. Oh, they're friends! They shoot for you. Okay. Wait, is that completely pointless? There's nothing down here? Oh, rest in pieces. Was there another water thing over here? Yes. I just want to check everything. Right, fish form, go. Wait, no, I think I went here already. Yeah, that's this guy. How you doing, buddy? <laughs> I don't know what Tilt and Tumble did exactly. I haven't played it. I've seen somebody play it on a GameCube, though, at SGDQ. That was pretty sweet. Or whichever GDQ it was. Oh no. Most recent GDQ? Alright. I think they might have done it twice though. But yeah, it's a it's a pretty cool run. Thank you, save Dave. So is anybody keeping up with the uh, one shot let's play? That'll be over pretty soon. Two more videos. But yeah, that that solstice, that extra chapter is really great. I was Honestly, not expecting something so complete. That was pretty impressive. I won't talk spoilers here, but it's it is very much worth the watch if you if you had been missing it. So does Harpy? I don't have an attack yet. Maybe soon. We got waterfall relic. What? What is what is waterfall relic? What do? While using water based form up, press up while sending a waterfall. Oh, okay. Uh, oh. Rest in pieces, health, or magic. Ow. Pretty sure I already went through here. Yes, I did. WTF story? I think they're making some other game. Like, they're rebooting um, some project with a rabbit boy and this cat girl. I don't... It looked like it was like an action platform or something. I don't know exactly what it was. It was like Rip the Rabbit or something. I think I'm still missing an item from that area. So I think there were two, and I think I only got one. Thick burb. 
WTF story was a case story maybe way back of Vanden partway through. Hmm. Okay, got everything there. Oh, yeah, I'm missing something there. Uh, am I missing something important there? And where is it, if so? Oh, I'm missing a heart container, too. If it's for collect the thon crap, I don't care about spoilers at this point. I just want to get all the things. Oh yeah, the reboot reboot is terrible. I mean, we don't know. It looks terrible, I mean. It's a live action reboot of a show that was famous for being CGI. Like, I'm not sure if that's like... Like, it's like whitewashing CGI, almost. It's the same complete lack of understanding of the source material. Which seems to be going around uh, an incredible rate at uh, Hollywood. The there is I can't say it without spoilers, so I won't. But there was something regarding the whitewashing in um, what's it called? Uh, in Ghost in the Shell that was just stupid. I'll, I was missing scrap metal. That's crap because I need that. Oh dang! I'm almost done with the sunken souls at least. But basically, they like work the whitewashing into the story, which is like, wow. Hollywood is freaking weird, man. How do I get back in there? Also, why do tiny bubbles destroy massive rocks? Ooh, what's this? Oh, hey! I can go up this now! I guess I did these in the right order then. Oh, it's a health up. Hmm. All right. No work. Oh, maybe I have to be up there. Ah, here we go. Before it always gets great music. Oh, here we go. Oh! That's how you get in here. Okay. Harpy Talon. Oh, that must be the attack thing. Uh, the thing with her hair whip is that I have, like, I've tripled the speed of the animation because of the thing I have, so that's why it looks so crazy fast. But, like, you can't really have a properly speeded... Oh. Oh, I need crab. Like, in order for the animation to not look a little jerky, they would have to make it so slow that it's, like unbearable, so. It's just kind of one of those video game things you gotta deal with. Ow. I hope that's all from there. Is it this? Okay, so... Hey buddy, how you doing? Oh! I broke it. <laughs> you shoot feathers? Great. 
strong, powerful, dangerous. Pirate's Curse gets insanely difficult at the end, and I don't really appreciate it. It seems pretty unnecessary, too, because, like, it doesn't match the rest of the game, and, like... I don't know about the first one, but... Oh! How the hell do I get in there? Monkey form, maybe? No! This seems like where I need to go to... to get to the thing. Maybe bat form. Maybe with bat form from here. Oh no, it's too low. Oh, wait, no, it's harpy. It kind of moves too fast. You gotta love the murderous mouse bite. The bite is bigger than the entire mouse. It's just a vortex of teeth. There we go. Oh yeah, I knew I needed mouse. I already have mouse. There we go. But I didn't know how to get in there. In fact, I thought I tried to get in there before. I hope this goes to where I think it does. Oh, you like lunge forward with the bite. Yeah, I thought the mouse was a pretty neat power up. This isn't where I thought it would be. Oh, it's a key. I like that instead of going for the pitch shifting. They they just retook they did retakes on the lines and there's a couple where she's just like super bored and some she's like super excited for transform. There we go. I think this leads to whatever was over here. These things look kind of like a Zelda enemy of some sort. Like a not quite Moldorm. Man, the frickin' Nagas got buff! It can be used to an okay effect, but... Pitch shifting is obviously a little bit, a little bit lazy and a little. It could sound really weird. They used it really badly in um, in Pokemon Sun Moon for the Tauros charge thing. Every once in a while, it makes this extremely shrill noise, and like it, it just shouldn't have shifted that far. Oh, there's small versions of the Tazzletown boss? I already noticed that. Alright, let's just leave. I guess I can just harpy around now. Ow. Well, I guess if you mash it, it's can deal an okay amount of damage. You fly like you're freaking lubed up with the harpy, it's really weird. You even run a little weirdly. 
I guess burbs aren't really built for running, though. It's kind of a shame she doesn't hop. I, I like when birds hop. Hop birds are the best birds. Oh, in fact, um, the new Wonder Boy game, when you're in hawk form, you hop, which is great, instead of running. Oops, I keep using that one on accident. Oh, that's not... There we go. I guess I should cook these. How cook? Right, this thing. No! I should probably just turn that off. The thing that speeds up your transformation sequence. Because I just end up missing it every time. Let's see if there's anything I can I missed with Harpy. I don't think I've checked in here with Harpy. Oh, never mind. You can't go up. Can Harpy climb on these? No. Slip more slippery than Luigi. Which is weird because you think talents would like stick in the dirt and make you, like, really have too much traction, if anything. Pound flower for scrap. Oh! Oh, right, I forgot about that. Thank you. I'm sure I've missed plenty of those. This is where what's your face was. Go back, last area had flower. I think it might be too late for that. Oh. Some things you can't go back through. Okay, here we go. I'll check from the map, because I think there's a scrap metal I missed in that second area. And then there would just be one more. Alright, so I'm looking for a scrap metal there, right? Now I got all the scrap metal here. So it's probably... Oh, I'm missing one sunken soul here. Clean up Main Street first. regret this, but I'm gonna try upgrading the bitrate to 3 megabits. Not sure why exactly I settled on 
Maybe I'll immediately find out. I don't know. Alright, I'm looking for freaking flower. Ah, no! My plan to be lazy with the harpy backfire. Stairs have a hidden compartment? Oh, check that out then. It looked like some of those blocks might be blocking something, like the destroyable ones. I don't think I ever found anything behind them, but maybe there's just more. Harpy's kind of nice for just skipping over the whole section, though. Transform. Not entirely fast, but definitely low effort. So I'm looking for a flower and stairs. Monkey hole. Or mouse hole works too. Ah! We're gonna be ret to go for that frickin' uh, final area. Can't be that many heart holders left. Where's the flower though? Clever trick to make this look hidden just by not scrolling the screen. Am I? I'm not seeing where this flower would be. Did I miss a flower when I was in that map? Hmm. They've underestimated the length of the collect all of the things part of the game. Hidden under blocks. Aw, oh, crap. Alright. I guess I may as well get backdashed. It's only 30. Oh hey, invincibility shield. That's nice. Yeah, let's get max attract, sure. Figures I had to hide stuff in the most annoying way. Let's just finish this place first.
Getting all arbor keys gives infinite magic? Really? That's cool. Do you remember if it was in the first or the second section? The flower. I like the disinterested transform, because you know you would get tired of shouting transform. So you'd just be like, yeah, I'm on the clock here, I'm just gonna transform. Whatever. Not a big deal. Pretty sure a second. Yeah, I don't think there's a place that could have been here. Where's the stupid flower? These are clearly feathers, not talons. There we go. Where are you supposed to find that? See anything different since I upped the bitrate? Bitrate. I'm pretty sure Twitch's max bitrate is. Yeah, it's 3.5, which. Not going to the max, so. Everything there. One, one something soul there. Two heart pieces there. Boring. I think I'll go here since I haven't been here in a while. these lizard people. I don't remember there being lizard people previously. Excuse me, sir. I just realized. Oh wait, there's probably nothing here. So I could probably just... No, no! Go to the next area. Can't imagine there's much hidden stuff in the auto scroller. Excuse you.
forgot I had monkey form. Pretty good form. Oh, there we go. It's got potato mashers. Who even makes all of these urns? There's so many. Alright, screw it. I don't think that ends. The cannon has a happy face! I never noticed that until now. Good cannon. Already got that. Out of the way, buddy. I don't care how happy you are, you're in the way. You must die. Oh, right, that's the one that looks like you can jump, but you can't yet. Frickin' 3.5D bullshit. Oh, for Pete's sake! Ah. Uh, 2.5D. I'm not sure what 3.5D would be. I'm not sure the human brain is ready for 3.5D. Oh, come on! scrolling. Ow. Surprisingly accurate cannon. Ooh! Oh no. Oh no! Okay, bullage? What, what buttons? What buttons? The is it attack? What goes fast? I gotta go fast. Mouse? Not mouse. Spide? Can I destroy these? Now! What are we, what are we doing here? Elephant? Oh. Oh, come on! Oh, for fuck's sake! What an incredibly annoying room. Oh, for fuck's sake! Oh my god. Oh, for shit's sake, you gotta be kidding me. If you're too close and transform, you get wider and... You... I don't think that works. Transform. Yeah, Transform. Oh, for 
fuck's sake. Can I attack with Spide? I don't think so. Charge in the top part is that background. I don't think so. I don't think that would change anything anyway. Guy yeah, says monkey bullet. I tried monkey bullet. Well, I'll try it again. seem like it's gonna work. Unless... No. Oh. It's like... Just incredibly precise. Oh, that was only a heart holder? Here or something? I feel like I'm missing something. Hmm. Oh, right, there's even more to the level. Okay, never mind. Monkey was well fine. Yeah, that was kind of crazy. There we go. Death Pit or Secret Pit? It is Secret Pit. I hate when games do that. At least it's fairly rare in this. Of course, they're immune to lasers. I see you. I see you. Got all the scrap metal. Um... Is there something else? I think there's at least one more item in here. Like maybe an attack for the spider? Mermaid Waterfall. Oh, I'll be 
back. Is this where I'm actually supposed to go? Off, oh, Pete's sake. Oh, I see that hole. It was made for me. He's got a turning animation. Good for him. Wait, I need to be monkey first. Then go through a hole. No, monkey. Wait, did I go through this already? Wait. Um. I'll just be harpy and avoid spikes that way. Watch there be spikes on the ceiling now. Ah! Well, not the ceiling, but close. Transform! What? Oh, bat! Transform! I don't know why I didn't think of that before. Oh, for Pete's sake. Here we go. Spider Venom! Let's see, those are spider attack. Wait, can spiders see in the dark too, maybe? Nope. Alright, I'm just gonna harpy out. care about the gems. I feel like I'm missing the other thing if I keep going this way though. So there's a mermaid waterfall back somewhere? Wait, what? Oh, I see. Puzzle. Monkey time. Oh no. Oh, in the pool you gotta go up a waterfall? Alright. I love the expression on when, when you do the bullet thing as a monkey. Heart piece? In the pool is a spot. All right. Yeah, I was afraid that was the right way to go, so I left. Oh, you can jump over him. Oh, whatever. That probably warps me in the front. That works. I really like purple thread here. It really does help with exploration, even if it is a little awkward. Right, 
the required things. I think it's just, uh, oh, I see what you mean. Um, that one sunken soul. Oh, it's one of these kind of things, huh? See, Mr. Rosen. Can't do that one at all. Ah, here we go. What we? Oh, so I get our key. All right. I think that's everything here. Actually, wasn't too bad. Ah, oh, we did miss one thing. Yeah, it's not sure we could be. All right, let's get the thing for Mr. What's His Butt. Ammo Baron, I guess. Oh, I guess we could buy some more stuff too. I think hair damage would be the best, probably. I think I can only get one. Yeah. Yeah. How many keys do I have? Six. Uh, yep, scrap battle for yours truly. You know, you ain't half bad, babe. I'll share a little secret with you. I had a run in with old Missy Boots some time ago and she dropped this. We got Misty's pendant. Or Risky's pendant. Never liked how that gar gar gal throws her weight around. Hey, that thing helped you take her down a peg, huh? Keep it between you and me. Why did she drop, like, all of her clothes? Like, calm down, Risky. Like, dang, we've got a lot of clothing from her. Like, what is left at this point? Oh, area concept art. Is that... Is that island on the bottom left thing there? Is that, like, an octopus as an island? Can I zoom in? I thought you could zoom in. Yeah, Ra Braid, I recall finding a bit frustrating. Next one is her underwear. I wouldn't be entirely surprised. More area concept art. Beautiful statue of a crab dog demon angel. Majestic. Yeah, we don't have enough to... We're missing a couple more. I wanted that infinite magic, but I don't think we have. Oh, hey, fan art! What? Who? I'm sorry, what? Now, these people I recognize, but... Who, 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 I don't know what's happening here. How is this Shantae fan art? Well, I don't... Is, is that the secret actual cast of the game? Oh, that one's pretty good. Risky Risky is not here on her own terms. Look at her face. She's not enjoying the situation. Oh, 3D one. Pew pew pew. Hair drill. Ninja form. <laughs> I don't think I don't think some of these are Shantae fan art. Oh. Hello, friend. You're exceedingly useless, you know that friend? Shisha <laughs> It's the thing. <laughs> She's throwing her head like freaking misfortune. No pixels.
Oh, this one's a big one. <laughs> Sean Day by Roy, age 24. Amazing. Artistry. Oops. It's so beautiful I had to see it twice. There's harpy form. Sea snack form. But there's a lot. Oh, there's just one more. Oops. I did it again. Oh, more fan art. Well, I'll just use up all my keys. I'll look at the art later. Oh my. Oh my. This room is too horny for children, I'm sorry. There's things happening. There's various things happening. Not safe for children's. Alright, this room is less horny. Children are allowed in here. Locked. Okay, so I'm missing... I'm only missing two? Hmm. That's tempting. I'm not sure how much infinite magic. I guess I could do infinite heals then, right? If I got infinite magic. After the frickin' ridiculous <laughs> the shipping room. Yes, that's the shipping room. Um, after frickin' Pirate's Curse uh, final area, I'm kind of ready to be completely overprepared for the final area of this game, though. I never did beat that game. I would like to beat it. So one key here. One sunken soul. One key here. Two heart pieces. Hmm. Let's, let's get the sunken soul first. We gotta get them risky undies, or whatever the last clothing item that she dropped was. Oh, she's a pirate though, she might not wear undies. I wish the frickin' Naga was playable. Like, she is so awesome. She's way cooler than me, honestly. I want her to beat me up and take my lunch money. Practice harpy form? I guess. Reasonably comfortable with heartbeat form. There we go. Not really sure where the sunken soul would be because I th thought I was pretty thorough down here. There's just one left. Excuse me. Take a second look, see. I wish there was some kind of like, there's an item on this map indicator. That would help a lot. As far as collectathons go, it's not really too bad. It's not like DK64 level of collectathon. That that game, that was legitimately the game that made me realize, oh, 3D games aren't always better forever. Huh. I I, I loved the DKC trilogy, and I, I, there was a new Donkey Kong game. I had to get it. It was gonna be so great. I... I did not enjoy that game. There's some kind of okay aspects, but 
Uh, DK64 is very best. It's just kind of a bad DK or Mario 64. Yeah, I think we've checked everything outside, so it must be inside then? DK64 is like everything wrong with collectathons. Like different flavored bananas for every character, and you have to get like all of them. I mean, maybe not all of them, but you had to get an incredible amount of them in order to progress. And like, oh my god. It's probably like, I can't imagine there's anything even more collectathon y than that. Yeah, you're probably right about that. Citizen Snips! <laughs> I love that her expression just doesn't even change, just like, yeah. Oh, ukulele better not be anything like DK64. <laughs> Didn't they, like, specifically say they had kind of reined it in a bit in ukulele, the collectathonism? So I can't handle. I can't handle another DK64. I couldn't handle the first DK64. This, that's just not happening. Was, um... Was Banjo-Kazooie after or before DK64? Cause like... Oh, hey. Oh wait, no. I already got all of those. Useless water. I don't get it. Where is it? Banjo Kazooie was the first 60. Really? That that doesn't make sense to me. Cause like to me, like DK64 feels like the sort of thing you would make if you were like first trying something out and you like went way too over eager and you know then you make your more polished banjo kazooie after that but like that's weird if they made the better game first oh diddy kong racing was the first i know that's i mean that's a, that's a really different game diddy kong racing i really liked i like that better than mario kart Cause it had the it had the better battle games. Even and don't I never liked the racing aspect competitively as much. Cause it wasn't like as exciting. But Diddy Kong Racing had these cool objective modes, and uh, I just found those really fun. <gasps> Ooh, precious treats. Um, I found those a lot more fun to do. Be full up on Gator's sake. That's our key. I think that's everything. I guess Donkey Kong. I guess Diddy Kong Racing is a little collectathony, but it's not. It's not the 3D platformer. Banjo Kazooie, Banjo Tooie, Donkey Kong 64, and finally Kong. Really? I guess maybe they they had their success with the Banjo games and thought they would add even more collectibles. I don't know. That just seems like a strange progression to me. I guess they may as well look through Tasseltown. I'm not sure if Conquer. I never really played Conquer though. I played it in an emulator once, but just literally once, one attempt. I'm gonna go to Tasseltown, because that. That pretty much finishes everything up, and like, I might as well, at that point. Yeah, I don't need... I won't have all of the things, but... Where was this? Oh right, he was creeping in the frickin' uh, bathhouse. What a creep, get out of here. Ha ha ha! Sunken souls, lay them at my feet! Okay, 
He gave sunken soul. See how they quiver and wriggle in fear of their master. You have done well. I will give you a gift. You got Risky's ribbon. Well, that's what she wears as underwear. That object is an ornament of pure hatred. Finders keepers. Thanks, Sipno Baron. You get a trophy on your face. There you go. Good luck building your fear empire. Get out of here. I need to do the bath thing fully clothed. You know, all, all pure girls bathe completely clothed. You know. All right, let's get the last crap from uh, what's it town. I wonder what trophies. Uh, there's probably I think there's like a speed runny sort of trophy. Like beat the game in a couple hours or something. So from detection from all the techno grunts. I guess it's like don't get seen in that second area. Behind Tassel Tower. Leap over every canister. Huh. I need to win it. Didn't I didn't I get that? Wait, no, that's probably beat everybody up on the magic carpet ride. Got as many friends as possible for sweet. Oh, that's probably the starfish thing. Avoid all the gears in the end of the game slide. Beat the game. 100%. Well. Oh, wait, no, there's, there's one thing here in Cape Crustacean. But I'm just going to get the heart pieces and hopefully that last key. No, dissolve gains did not come out in the order that you played them. Yeah, I've made that mistake before. The SNES's library is weird to me because my first game was um, Yoshi's Island. I think that's one of the later, like one of the last, maybe not last, but one, definitely one of the later ones. And it's also just very weird for me to think of games that have that came out in the 80s because the NES was all before me. I never had an NES until uh, a tenant actually abandoned one at one of my parents' rentals. So I have that. It's a little beat up. Came with a decent amount of games, though. Nothing super amazing. It's got Metroid, it's got Mario. Mario 1, but no Mario. Um... I don't think it had Mario 2 or 3, which is the ones I would be more interested in personally. Though I have all of those on GBA. Well, I have. I actually don't know if I have Mario 3 in any form. I've beaten Mario 3. I never liked games before you could save, because, like, I wasn't, I wasn't good enough to beat them in, like, a single setting as a kid, so... Like, if I couldn't save, it just meant I couldn't beat it, and I didn't, I didn't like that. I still don't like that! Oh, I think that's the thing I haven't gotten before. Oh, you can't transform in water? Like, untransform? Oh, I think I just noticed something with how the things are laid out. I think I've been here. Yeah, I have. I think the water one is always on the bottom, the flying one is always at the top. So that makes it a little easier to remember. Mm. If I explored all the water, I'm not sure what I would have missed. I love the side eye the thing gives you when you're hitting it. Like, yeah, you freaking kids. You millennials in your hair. God damn it. Alright, let's let's double check this, okay. Okay, yeah, so flying thing at the top, small thing at the right, swimming thing at the bottom, and miscellaneous at, at the left. No real common thread there. Mm. Oh, I think that's new. Huh? Oh. I think you need to be Crabbo. Oh, 
What the? Okay. Ow! Stop that. Go back to Castlevania. No! I already did that! What a waste. Oh well. Yeah, not really sure where I would have missed something here, honestly. I thought it was pretty thorough. Collectathoniness is getting a bit annoying at this point, but I guess when there's only like four, I think, items left, it's not too inexcusable. It's about the right time for a collectathon to be too much. Do, do I need to do something with all of these, maybe? Castle Town has a bunch of mouse sections? Oh, that must be it, because I don't think I had mouse last time I came here. Hmm. Keep an eye out for mice bits, I guess. Donkey Kong 64 did look really good, though. I remember thinking it looked pretty great. Transport. Zelda games honestly tend to test my uh, collectathonness too. Um, I usually don't end up with the 100%, for example. I did it multiple times for Ocarina of Time and uh, um, Majora's Mask. Those are my favorites. And Link to the Past. Only once, I think, for Link to the Past. I didn't actually have that as a kid, I just borrowed it. So no replays for that one. I did everything except that stupid, terrible baseball minigame in um, Link Between Worlds. That was... that was just bad. That was bad and it should feel bad. Oh, right. I don't see these mouse sections. Oh, here we... oh. Now I've been here with mouse. feeling the necessity of finishing up Tasseltown. Right, I must have checked all these too because I was looking for the souls or whatever. The grody dead people but Harpy at top? Alright. Speaking of Harpy, Probably a better way to get around. I hope it's the key, because I might have infinite magic if so. Check walls? I already did check walls though. Because of the elephant thing. Like, I bet I've been in here. Yep, because you had to do it for the thing. Yeah, I'm sure I've done most or all of that. Ow. Transform. Now this part, I, huh? What? What do you mean? Oh, Spidey? Maybe? No, I don't think Spide. Oh, 
Oh wait, monkey, monkey, monkey. Maybe? Wait, will monkey even? Yeah, m never mind. I think, oh. <laughs> That's the room you're talking about, okay. I don't know how I missed this one. Maybe I didn't get up here before. Because I've been in here with mouse, I think. The, mo the mouse is a really cute little puzzle. I like the mouse form. Alright, what's my pre present? Oh. Only one heart left. I love the dust trail from the mouse. Best character. Right, I just want to see if I can barf poison upside down. You can! Good news. Went in that one. I wonder if I just bolted as soon as I had the necessary things. That seems like me. I think I must have been in here. Because this would be a genie thing, and I think I have all of those except possibly one in a uh, different area. I'm thinking about the top, so I'll go check it out after this. I remember this. Could get up here. Ah oh, no! That means the one I wanted is the one, of course. Ugh. Just gotta go check all the wall sections, I guess, then. Broke or yes, it is. Our, uh, can't get in there. Nah. They're blocked for you to hit down saw room. Where was saw room? Oh, this one. Looks like gems, but I'll check just in case. Check all of them at this point, it's gotta be one of the last ones. I uh, can't get to that. Upper saw room. There's an upper saw room? looking, I guess. A 
proper sorrow. This? I can't reach this one though. That's a blocky knockdown? Oh, this? Really? That's freaking crazy. I would I would not have thought of that. I'll be damned. What the heck is this? Huh? Oh no. Do, do I have to move these around like in the right order or something as elephant? Oh no. Oh shit. Uh oh. This could be bad. Okay. And I already screwed it up. Congratulations. Okay, so that's not how that goes. Fuck. Alright. So this one's gotta be the first right one. So now I need something that's three notches down. Which I guess is this one. Alright, it's not as bad as I thought. I think. I need something that's four notches up. So that's that one. Okay. Nah, it's really not that bad, it's just it's scary. Wait, but, huh? Oh, I bet I can, oh, I think you can go into this one after, yeah. Maybe? Oh, it's just really faint. Why is it so dark? The other ones are really bright and glowy. Whatever, I, I solved the puzzle, it's fine. I figures the most grueling one would be the final key. So who else is super ready for the weekend? I had freaking I had jury duty on Monday, I kinda... It wasn't the worst, but it, it kinda just... Made me bleh the whole week. It was... I think I just leave here now. Um. <coughs> Sneeze. Um. They were two over two hours late. They um. They didn't need me. They had way more than enough people. Like there were like sixty people. And like even if both of the lawyers used all their strikes, they wouldn't have needed me. Okay. Dare I find? Uh, you know what? It's the last item in the damn game. I guess I'm gonna go get that thing. You still playing Pokemon hacks? I guess if you like Pokemon, there's, there's probably enough hacks to keep you busy for like the rest of your lifetime, probably considering. There's a lot of them. Alright. What do I want? And my whipping speed is already pretty freaking fast. Now, invincibility sounds legit. See if we really get all of the mag like uh, max magic or whatever. All right, what's in here? Ah, backgrounds. I think this was in. Uh, I think this was concept art in the um, for the Kickstarter. 
I did Kickstarter. I, I was a Kickstarter for this, or a backer. What did I just do? Oh. I cast the thing. Good for me. Master of Unlocking. Character sketches. Oh man, the one with the eyes is freaking gross. Optional true form transformation. Ew. Oh, we didn't get demon, sassy demon lady. Small head, with large, longer legs. Whoa, angry Shantae in the middle there. Oh, cute, they have the animation notes. Oops, I keep doing that. All right, let's let's venture into the horny room. Th these ones are less horny than the first two. Exceedingly so. I'm disappointed, horny room. You're not horny at all. How dare you. This one's a little horny. Poor Sky. <laughs> Playing on your Game Boy. She looks like a Ren Stimpy, like, muscle man almost in that. Is, oh yeah, it's the what's-their-faces. The, the bomber twins or whatever. Don't know what that guy was. Gotta get them treasures. <laughs> I'm disappointed. This room wasn't horny at all. Oh, never mind. It got horny again. Do I get anything for opening all the doors? Let's ask the terrible mayor. Give me free stuff. Here you go, some Takri costume jewelry as a thank you for the job well done. You got magical tiara. So is that infinite magic? What is it? A fountain of magic wells within you. What do you mean? I don't have any magic though. Maybe I just have to refill. Not sure how this thing works. Oh, sweet! Okay, I do in fact have infinite magic. I just had to actually get magic in the first place. Alright. Let's get that last item, I guess. Just for completion's sake. Here, right? What would this be? I guess I'll just look it up. Uh, Cape Gustation. Uh, ow. Yeah, thanks a lot, Pepsi Man, by the way. You've been a big help. Uh, Cape. Gallery key. Already got that heart holder. I must be missing one specific thing here. So it should be. I got a guide open. Mouse mouse dance. Oh wait, no, I already have mouse dance. 
main stasis. Cape of Station 3. Redstone with red gems. Oh, this is the absolute worst item is the last one. Whatever. Spider form. Pass the first breakable box in the upper right behind the soldiers. What? the first breakable box in the upper right beyond the soldiers. Jump onto the mid-air platform. I think it's in the third section. Oh, they're fixing it up? That sounds cool. It didn't really seem that bad, but I haven't really been watching what all was going on. Past the first breakable box. It's right here. Past the first breakable box. So uh, jump onto the mid-air platform. Gem jug and a pair of spiked walls. Oh, oh, oh! I missed this. Pete's sake. I don't think I'm gonna 100% it truly because that required. I would have to grind gems. I just wanted to get all of the collectibles. Uh, I can't get everything you buy. Can't you only get one of the snake dances? But yeah, I don't have. I don't have the money. Well, I can buy one. But uh, I can't like upgrade all my magic. Yeah, I don't really want to... Yeah, I'll just head, head, go ahead. I'll get the actual 100% later. This is the place! Risky Boots is hiding the dynamo somewhere close by. One final word of warning. It's you! All your base have belonged to us. If the enemy seeds in the genie realm, turning the genie realm to evil, you must destroy us and our magic with us. Oh, gem purchases don't count? Really? I understand. I believe in what my friend said. I can't even think of myself as half good enough anymore. Everyone scuttle town. Secret land. The whole genie realm is counting on me. I'll stop risky boots at any cost. Ready. Except I'm actually going to go get the snake dance. Or the snake girl dance then. Gem purchases. Okay, so... Talk to Uncle Nemec? Okay. We're gonna save the world after this brief commercial break. Oh man. Is that. Do they even still do that? Like the garbage where they would like try to integrate the fact that there's a commercial break into the show? Uncle, look, I found it. Something. Oh! Oh, you have to turn these in! Oh, thanks for <laughs> warning me! I, I would I didn't even think about that. Here's to be Kate and Ash from a Metal Forge. I'll keep studying it. Good work. Any clues? Oh, this could be Risky Scuff Link. Let's have a look at that. Hmm. Smudge from ceiling, often used with insulated rubber hoses. I'll keep studying it. Good work. Yeah, I haven't watched TV in years. This might be Risky's Pendant. Let's have a look at that. Mm -hmm. There are oil spots on the surface. Not your typical grade either. Hmm. It smells of sulfur. Which this building uses heat as a power source. I'll keep studying it. That's the thing I need to find. Well, perfect! With these four clues, I should be able to decipher them. Hmm. Why are So the amplify the counterflow. Hmm. She wouldn't have known about the hamster wheel. It's a much larger magical insect valve. Eureka! Here's your answer. We got a magical polarizer! What's this? That is a magical polarizer! And that I mean, you can cancel the inversion process and redirect the magic into a lightning rod. Huh? If the pirate tries to switch your magic, you can switch it back 
right back again. Oh, I see. It's the bad ending aversion item. Good. Will it really work? No idea, but it's better than nothing. Thanks, Uncle Nook. Come on, she's got this. Kick her buns, champ. It's time to stop Risky Boots once and for all. What you doing, Risky Boots? Er, you. Alright. Let's go to Snack. I think I remember where Snack is. Let's go too far. Yep, it will. Oh crap. I wonder, can you get the achievement for jumping over all of the barrels? Even in a replay, or do you have to do like a whole new game? So her butt is going to be very sore after this. I don't care enough. I'll, I'll do that later. I'm just getting 100% of items, not the trophies. That's later. Why does Steam like to update random games for 0 to 5 megabytes? Like, like it, upgrade, it, it updated Cryptarch for 0 bytes. Is that like some weird DRM thing they do? Like, it does this almost every day. It'll update, like, five random indie games that I know don't have actual updates. Oh, speaking of, I have an update for Snake Pass. I need to actually play that. I, uh... It looks really cool. But I just didn't have time to play it yet. Minor fixes. I mean, may maybe for some of them, but it it seems like a lot of them probably just don't have anything. Like sometimes there's like literally zero. Oh wait, no, yeah, I can't skip this part. But can I only get one of the Snake Girls, um, things, though? I guess I get it faster as a puppy. Can't catch me on the Muffin Man. Muffin Harpy. I hope I don't need too many gems. I should be able to get 300. Hoping that's plenty. Get both, but they replace other dances. Are they free to swap, or does it like cost money every time? Swap, not payment? Oh, okay. Go on, get. Hi, Snack. Super revive dance.
I don't have a obliterate dance. Oh! Oh, I needed to obliterate. Oh, I needed exactly 300 gems. So that's good. Best skill. Amazing. I am unstoppable. Take this final boss. Can't touch this. I literally can't do anything but this. Best, best skill. Do I need the Super Revive Dance too to get 100%? Oh, this is just this again. I didn't get an achievement, so I don't know if I'm missing... Oh, maybe- do I have to beat the game? I don't know if I have everything. That counts for 100%, but whatever. I'll just finish the game now. It's not a big deal if I have to go back later. <coughs> a lot of games require you to actually beat the game to get a 100% achievement. Maybe it'll say. Achievement 100% completion. Nah, I don't know. Dang, 23% of people 100% of the game. That's... That's pretty impressive. Though... With Senor Kagura Shinobi versus, um, 20% of people had the Platinum, which is pretty intense. It wasn't a super hard Platinum, but it wasn't super easy either. Well, of course, we gotta use our things. Oh no, it's auto-scrolling! It's okay though, because it's like a shoot em up. I can deal with that. Oh, hell yeah! It really is like a shoot em up, you even get options. Oh, it's come to me, my friends. Children's. The swim team! Okay, this is completely inoffensive as far as uh, auto scrollers go. The most annoying with platformers is like, you, you want to make a jump and the game's just like, nah. Can't do that. Sorry. Just gonna have to wait a bit. It's for your own good, my friend. <laughs> Knock off their helmets. Poor Tinker Bats. So this is easier than the Pirate's Curses one, right? Because there's some like extreme Mega Man, you know, spike corridors in that. I'm not really in the mood for that tonight, but I do want to finish this. So I'll definitely give it the old college try, but... I want to finish that game too, eventually, but uh... Helicopters now. Good for them. Ah. 
They're really moving up in the world. Oh! <laughs> I see. That, that's a cute way to teach you things. Freaking um, Carnival Night Zone could have used something like that. What? what, what? Why do they put their boats on animals? What are, what are the Tinker Bats problems? This maneuver in between instant death things with Harpy and Monkey. Oh. Speak of the devil, I guess this is probably what you're talking about. Okay. Those do look extremely like uh, something from... Metroid. Oh, seriously? Oh, wait, maybe Monkey. Woo! That was a little close. Oh, what? You gotta be kidding me! I grazed it as a freaking monkey, and oh my god. The fact that you defeated enemies seems to, seems to stay, so... A little easier, at least. WHAT?! Aw, oh, come on! Get hit. Oh, you gotta. Ah, oh, it did it perfectly the first time, and I lost it. Ah, oh. that's a bit annoying. Mm. I think you can regain gain control in the air. As the harpy, you just don't immediately regain it. There we go. Oh, fr of course, it was right before the end. All right. Goopy, please. Get out of here. They still have infinite magic, so I'm basically fine. I, 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 I'm doubting this, but I must try. No. It was always a neat trick in Mega Man games. You can pretty much always abuse invincibility frames to walk on spikes. And uh, you can do some pretty cool stuff with that. Oh, you gotta be shitting me. Okay. <coughs> Alright, I forgot. I can attack as a harpy. That is actually quite useful, yes. Oh, excuse me. Um. There you go. Rip. Cool harpies don't look at explosions. Oh, that was stupid. I should not have done that. I was... I'm thinking this is like... You know, a game with very lack... Or... <laughs> it's, it's one of those games where if you get too close to the side of the spike, it will still kill you. Mega Man, at least, when side spike... When touching the side of a spike will kill you, at least the, the, there's like a diagonal spike that indicates, yeah. If you come here, if you come too far to the... Oh god, no. I see where this is going. Oh no. Oh no. That's not how that works. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Ooh. 
No, 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 no. Okay, okay, no, okay. Yeah, this isn't really too bad. Oh. <sighs> Gotta not go too fast. Oh. The fuck is this? The fuck is this? Excuse me? Oh, wait, monkey? Okay, I was about I was about to swear things were gonna be said. But all right, that's not too bad. All right. This game's so generous with healing stuff, with healing items. I don't think I even need infinite magic to uh, to do totally fine here. Oh goodness! No! Aw, oh, come on! All right, so that is higher than it. The floor is higher than it looks. It's good to know. Oop. Pardon me. Okay, do not get anywhere near the freaking floor. Always right before the end. Hey, save Dave. That point it never occurred to you to use monkey for 30 minutes. Oh no. Yeah, that seemed that seemed too unfair for a Shantae game. Even if it is, I doubt that's possible. That that doesn't look possible. Looks like this is the end of the line. Must be getting close now. Hello, additional save Dave. Oh, thank you. I figured a goody two-shoes like you might find a way to reverse the effects of dark magic. I assure you, the process is now irre irreversible. Where's the dynamo, Risky? Oh, ho. you'll see soon enough. It's in the tender, loving care of my Tinker Bats. Oh, yeah, the heartbeat doesn't seem too bad. Uh, my men have been working tirelessly to unlock the dynamo's full potential. It'll be beyond anything in your short-sighted uncle you and your short-sighted uncle could ever dream of. Until the work is complete, I won't allow you to interfere. Risky Boots, Queen of the Seven Seas. Risky. You're not even trying. I mean, I know it's the first phase and all, but come on, girl. You can do better than this. There you go. Oh man, now I miss the Shine Spark from, um, from, uh, the second one, or the third one. Pirate's Curse. Oh, she's got all of her abilities from Pirate's Curse, okay. Taunting me that I don't have her stuff. Pirate's Curse. Ow. Oh, we have a lot of freaking HP. I guess these games tend to compensate. You can do a lot of damage really fast with Shantae, but the bosses are kind of designed with that in mind. I guess I should have gone for that hair whip speed. Oh wait. Uh, I don't really have anything that would hurt her very much. Even with my infinite magic spam ability. The pike ball is a little okay, but... Oh, 
I like it's instant defeating the freaking Tinker Bats, though. There we go. <laughs> Why does she explode? I think they patched Harpy a bit because they remember being thrown around from a single this flap. The end, risky boots. Oh. Maybe. They did at least update the thing. Stability fixes additional game balancing hardcore mode. I mean, maybe that's the game balancing. Give up. Ha. Yeah. Now I'll introduce you to the final phase of my boss fight. I mean plan. There's probably at least two more boss phases to go, honestly. Pfft, it's a skull. Behold! What is it? It's a thing. The new and improved dynamo. <laughs> it's got spooky eyes. It looks more like a wacky, like, thing from um, Ratchet and Clank than Shantae enemy. What have you done to it? My Tinker Bats have increased its potential in every way. My mode to victory has arrived. Watch as I turn your precious genie realm inside out. <laughs> She's gonna open the gateway to the genie realm. I have to destroy the dynamo before it's too late. Tinker Brain, dynamo of destruction. Yeah, there's there's enemy or er, like characters in um, um, Ratchet and Clank that look very much like this thing. <coughs> am, am I supposed to do something with something or? RP me? No. Uh... Elephant, maybe? I've hit the thing bouncing around. Doubt this will work either. Nope! Ow. think of anything that would help here. Do, do I have to use the thing, maybe? No? First shot. Oh wait, the thing! Oh, you spin the gear, the, the the screws on its head? I see, okay. Now I got it. I noticed the things went, like, spun around, but it... I didn't notice the filling up sort of animation. He was really useful. Oh, maybe. Be. Oh no! 
some crunchy oranges. The most, the best variety of oranges. Rip. It's not really very intimidating, honestly. For looking vaguely skull-like. That can't have been the final form, though, so... It's definitely just phase two. Oh, you can just spin it with Harpy? Oh. Phew, that was close. I deactivated the dynamo just in time, and the genie realm was safe and sound. Except for the thing! Huh. That voice. You've battled valiantly and accomplished so much. Spooky evil genie. Bad thing's gonna happen. I guess it is a bit more brainy. Maybe. Daughter of the genies. It's you! You've risked your life time and time again to fight for justice and to serve others. You are forever grateful for your kindness and loyalty. Oh hey, you have a form. Hello, other genies that are identical. On behalf of the entire genie realm... Oh man, I'm kinda glad I'm half genie, because I mean... The whole no legs thing? I don't know about that. We thank you from the bottom of our hearts. I guess the ears are genie feature too. No way! Is this the genie realm? Why is this thing in the genie realm? Unfortunately, huh. the corruption of our magic has begun. Do what you must to ensure peace. Oh no. But I have the thing! Ho ho ho, I've finally done it! The heart of the realm of the magic. The power of the genies will be mine. Now do my bidding. Submit to me as your absolute ruler. But I have the thing. Boop. And now evil things. You got you, you get red hair when you're evil. That's how it happens. No! It worked! The power of the genies is mine! The world will bow before me. <laughs> oh yeah, and the belly and the hips are definitely from the genies as well. Weird to have hips like that when you don't have legs. But then Snake Girl had good hips too. Before Risky can come capture the power, I have to do it. I have to destroy the magical the genie realm at any cost. But but no, I have the thing! I have the thing! Where's the polarity of magic? Ow. Oh. I see. close enough for government work. I'm focusing a boss fight, but there's some excellent discussion on Lamia. Anatomy in the chat. Oh no! Yeah, yeah, calm down, buddy. so early. Oh, 
no, it's like totally open. Started up, you're screwed. Oh, they do eventually disappear. Oh, no! Worst possible timing. <clears throat> Centaurs have two rib cages. I guess they would. They would have two of a lot of things, though. <clears throat> or four of a lot of things in some cases. There you know two times the normal amount of things. Oh, come on. I'm gonna eat I'm gonna delete eat a delicious crunchy orange. You know, none of the things that we eat should crunch. But they all crunch. There we go. Hey, James. Brain basher. I guess it was a brain. Oh yeah, crayon physics. That was kind of fun. That was one of the first games I tried to play with my tablet. It, it's not really built with tablet controls in mind, unfortunately. Uh, at least it wasn't way back then, but... Touch controls were pretty rare way back then. Fool! Blasted, no good, wretched, meddling runt! You've ruined everything! My perfect, perfect plan! I almost had it all, but now... I'll have the satisfaction of sending you straight to Fiery Grave! <laughs> I've got to get out of here! Wh when do I use the thing, though? Oh no, it's the zombie's thing. Huh. What's this? You got the zombie hamster! Looks more like a tiny Godzilla. Hang on tight, we're getting out of here! Why didn't the polarity thing do anything? Oh, whatever. Oh, this again. Oh, butt is going to be so sore. And pants are going to be very not there. Oh, and there's lava. We gotta have lava. Oh, you can get on these. Okay. Wait, oh. Oh, we're in, like, the forest thing. Okay. Rest in peace, forest. Uh-oh. Whoa. Rude. Can't read chat right now, by the way. For reason. Ow! Aw, oh, come on. I was doing so well. Up. Oh, never mind. Soiled it. Uh oh. Oh no! Don't leave the screen. Okay. Feels really Rayman right now. A little, yeah. Bye bye, Volcano. Apparently, volcanoes erupt just by completely exploding like a giant robot. Oh, we made it. That was a close call. Too close. Thanks a lift, Sky. Someone's got to keep an eye on you. 
Looks like Sequence Land safe from evil once again. Yep, thanks for a half genie hero. <laughs> Couldn't have done it without you guys. Hold up there. Aw, oh, Mayor, get get out of here. Nobody don't ruin the credits, Mayor. So uh Skittle Town's more or less repaired and uh, the position of Guardian Genie is still open. Are you trying to ask Shante something, Mayor? Okay, okay. I can't think of anyone more qualified than you. Will you come back, pretty please? I never even left. Phew. I was gonna have to put on the red outfit and start dancing around, you know? <laughs> no, that's that's how this should go end. Haha, <laughs> oh mayor. So I guess I won't do that then. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Not that that's my fantasy or anything. <laughs> anyway, and everyone say guilt hey hey hi to the new guardian genie of Scuttletown, yay! And then he just waddles away. I think you made an excellent choice. Kids. Hey, Uncle. Thank goodness you made it out in one piece. I saw the eruption. I feared I lost you. I'm fine. It's you land safe, thanks to you guys. Yeah, I helped out a lot this time. It's feeling pretty heroic, you know? I mean, he almost became a low-budget mermaid, so I mean, that's... It's helping. Gotta dream big. I'm taking off, too. My brothers, Abner and Poe... They're thinking about renovating that old mansion up north. How cool! I'm gonna help them out. Wait, if you're a zombie, wouldn't renovating it, like, make it bad? Like, you want the decrepit mansion. I think I'm gonna find that zombie caravan and travel a bit. I miss my wagon. Gonna paint your wagon, gonna paint it good. I miss my wagon, I wanna see more of the world. And you should come with me. Zombie road trip? Sure, why not? Oh man, it is so nice to not have drop frames because of stupid internet issues. It is a complete relief. Haha, <laughs> let me chew on it. Take good care, Dookie. Of Dookie. Huh? Hose hamster! Alright, I have zombie hamster now. I better get going, too. Need to feed Wrench and get him cleaned up. You heard to tell me how he managed to grow so huge. What's your secret? It's a special diet. Salted caramel for birds. Wrench goes nuts for him. Ha, <laughs> I see. I think I'm gonna get, set him free for a while so he can spend some time with his family. Knowing Wrench, he won't be long. He's crazy about you. I'm crazy about him right back. You know, do you think zombies like to live in cold, decrepit crypts? I guess that's more of a mummy thing. Hello, Parker. Yes. He's looking at me. He's like, human. Human, I must pester you. It's been an hour since I have pestered you, human. My, my, what an adventure you've had. I'm sorry about the dynamo, uncle. No, no, that's all right. How about you? Are you okay? What really happened back there? First, he used the dynamo to change the genie realm from good to evil. For a short while, I was actually there in the genie realm with them. It's something I always dreamed of. But to stop Risky, I had to... Well, they're all gone now. All of... That was all of them? I'm sorry. I know you only did what was required. You had to, and you understand. I'm sure your mother would be very proud of you. We're all proud of her. What? Who? When? Where? Why? She acted selflessly to put the needs of others before her own. The genies are fine! Then, the genie realm is safe? Yes. By purifying your magic and turning against the machine, you saved us all. Wow, I guess your polarizer did the trick, uncle. Aha, so it did. And what about my mother? Is she safe too? Your mother's alive and well in the genie realm. She's devoted herself to the protection of your world. She and the other genies must remain here, where their combined powers can ward off the greater evils that would seek to enter your world. This is why she had to leave long ago, along with the other genies. It was to protect us? Yeah. So, you can grow up under the safety and care of your uncle. Risky's oddly successful. She's always pretty freaking successful, though. She kind of always goes, like... You know, right up to the very end. She wanted you to, to know this, but only when you were old enough to understand the meaning of her sacrifice. I understand. She also always wants you to know that you're never alone. Oh, There's a special magic and gift that she has placed upon your heart. For real? Your family's never away as you might think. Take comfort in knowing she's with you always. Even in the shower, which is kind of weird. And she loves you very much. Oh, I knew it. I knew you would interrupt me. Hello. 
Well, just, just come up on the desk. I know you're gonna do it. If you see my mother, tell her that I understand what she's done for us. That I love her right back. I will tell her. Good luck. And to you. Come on, Uncle. Where are we going? To celebrate, of course. To find you a new, less dangerous hobby. Ha. Huh. Reminds me. I recently unlearned the design for something called a bicycle. For my next project, I'm going to build one for you. Ah, oh, yes. The ancient machine. Bicycle. I guess they did turn to white balls. Okay. Hey, Uncle. Wait up. Until next time, daughter of the genies. Goodbye and farewell. Well, credits time. Oh. Well. Ugh. That was Sante Half Genie Hero. If you missed it, I uh, streamed basically the whole rest of the game. Um, I think you might have missed some minor collections between streams, but I got two other streams in this one. So you can pretty much see me play the whole game. Like everything, she gets almost everything she wants and only gets fun. Yeah, that's pretty much how things go. Shantae's... er, not Shantae. Risky Boots is pretty dang good as a villain, in terms of success. Yeah, glad to have you, Sam. I'll, I'll be streaming more now that my... well, the streams work. It's kind of helpful for streaming, to have the stream work. It's nice. Yeah, I should probably... I'll probably start up the regular 6 p.m. on Saturday and Sunday streaming thingy. I think I might take a break from the Yoshi and Kirby to just play whatever I want. Like, I'll try to announce in advance what it is, but there's a bunch of different games I can get to. Oh, is this this is the backer credits? This is that's gonna take a while. I'm I'm <laughs> I'm in here. Um, I forget if I use my real name or my uh, if I use her tap tap. Oh, you can fast forward, okay. Let's see if I'm in here, Sir Tap Tap. I honestly forget. Um. I didn't see. I. SI was very short. I missed it. Oh well. I'm sure I'm in there somewhere. When you think of streaming next, um, maybe it's pretty. Oh, 94? Really? Huh. But yeah, probably. Probably definitely Saturday sometime, maybe Friday. There was a Septon. The. Yeah, I don't remember if my real name or Sir Tap Tap is in there. You unlock Shantae Hero Mode. All right, there's different modes in this. I forgot about that. I don't know exactly what they do. Yeah, I think it was actually an early bird backer. Those went really fast. Hero Mode. Replay the adventure with your main transformations unlocked. Oh, that's cool. Aren't there also costumes? Can you... Can you equip costumes or, is, or am I thinking of something else? Also, I apparently have two pairs of bloomers, because they're just right up there. Was I thinking of something else with the costumes then? Because, I mean, I don't know. Also, like I said, the first stream, dang, girl has a lot of hair. Yeah, I really like- I wish you could play the whole game with, uh, Pajama Shantae. Yeah, 
Uh, I'm not sure it was actually put in as their tap tap, I forget. What's up, Buckle? Why is he called Mimic anyway? The Kickstarter, there were costumes that I've never seen them. Like, it would be a lot of work to, uh. She looks like a freaking, like. She looks like Shiva being summoned or something when she's falling with her hair down like that. I figured the extra modes would be the costumes, right? But I guess not? I don't know. Pepsi Man hasn't seen the costumes. I don't know huh? if they're in there. But woof, that was that was a pretty long stream. Thanks for watching, everybody. Um, expect some manner of stream this weekend. I'm not sure what I'll play. Oh, here's all. Weird. You don't. You don't get certain dances. You don't get the bat, which is weird. You don't get the fish, the the mermaid, which is pretty annoying. What was the other one? Oh, spider. It seems oddly picky, you know? Well, why not just give me everything? Whatever. Hello, Parker. Yeah, thanks for watching, everybody, and see you this weekend, maybe. Yes, hello. You are. You're too late. It's done. You can't ruin it anymore. Are you disappointed?